guys, it's Abby. And I'm Ethan, and today we're trying some beef jerky by Chew on This Jerky. My dad recently got uh, like a whole box full of them, and of course he bought them. But uh, we have three flavors today. We got teriyaki, uh, we got western, traditional western, and carne asada. And you have the little heat gauge here of how hot everything is. The two are kind of low, and the carne asada is kind of high. So let me see if I can try this real quick. You can, you can take one if you want, Abby. And just be a bystander. And you can switch your trade or something, I don't know. Oh, give me this baby proof. Seems like on. somebody's a baby. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> How's it taste so far? Mmm, that's really good. <laughs> I can't even open mine. I think that's pretty good. But I kind of saw a flavor, you know Let's switch. I thought it was kind of good. I thought it was not even that spicy. Let me grab a piece here. <laughs> They're kind of just like thinner spice, thinner pieces of beef jerky. But. Oh, I kind of like it. Mm. Oh, you got a traditional western? Yeah. Try teriyaki, maybe. No, I'm just going to keep eating this one. <laughs> Try something else. Carne asada is pretty good though. Hold on a second. Oh my god. These bags are gonna be gone. And if you guys want to send like more food or something, then do that because I don't know. I'm kind of hungry. But teriyaki flavor here. Yeah. This is like normal jerky. I think every normal jerky is like teriyaki. Traditional Western is like a kind of, let me see, kind of, uh, oh, kind of like a barbecue ish flavor, I guess. What do you think it tastes like? It tastes the same. Really? Oh no, it has a sausage kind of flavor. Not a barbecue. It looks like. Well, I mean, that's how beef it is. And it's a lot of it, anyways. It's pretty good, though. And there are other flavors. There are, like, many other flavors by Chew on This Jerky. These are just the three that were in a sort of package, I guess. Uh, the three that came in a package. And we get about three of each, I think we did. And, yeah. Oh, no, two of each. Two of each we got, so we got more for later, which is good. This is actually really good. Um, Priya, I need a, I need a, I need a, um, What do you do? Just, just. Hi. She just took some of that, but that's all right, I guess. Just can chew on this more. Uh, so while she's gone and probably munching on those, sadly, um, one thing I like about these is not only the taste, but like the texture of like when you eat them, not like other jerkies where they're all like tough. I mean, some people probably like them, but I kind of like them tender-ish, I guess. Well, it's not tough to the point where you like literally can't chew it. It's a good enough like chewing texture. Tastes great. Like I said, there's other um, flavors you can get other than the three that we have here, which is probably like good. I use one. So that's always good. Talking about texture. Uh, we want to thank Chew on This Jerky for sponsoring the Iron Giant Series race at the Siskiyou Golden Speedway uh, for the first annual Gold Rush 50 on May 26th. So if you guys can go ahead and attend that, that would be quite nice. Uh, any driver who registers can get their own promo code um, and hand it out to you know family, friends, or you know fans, and they could get 5% towards their own personal fund and 10% towards the championship fund of the Iron Giant series. Uh, me and my family, or my dad, him, um, we use Brian Cronk's code, which is here, and I'll have it on the screen. Let's see if you can see that. We'll have it on the screen as well. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to go promote your own promo codes out there, find a racer, find something to promote. And um, hand out promo codes to your friends so they can buy beef jerky. 
from Two on the Stir Key, and uh, thanks for watching.